Hello guys and welcome back to the crazy Minecraft video where today the villagers have gone ahead and invited us to investigate why there's dangerous monsters roaming around their village. Especially like the golem behind us that's chasing a cow and could instantly kill it. So let's go in and speak to the blacksmith and let's go see what mob spawners he has for us to try out. Blacksmith, where are you? I have a feeling he's left everything right inside his house. So let's go see what's inside the chest. Oh, we have loads of spawners. So thankfully, he's gone ahead and given us a full iron set that I'm going to put on instantly. And hopefully these spawners aren't too dangerous for us to try out. I'm going to take out every single one and let's go and do this. I have a feeling that Blacksmith instantly knew what we were going to do. Oh, there he is. Well, I'm going to take all these items and I'll bring back all the ones that are completely friendly. Well, guys, let's go and do this. But before we touch anything, I do want to go ahead and give a shout out to Sally as well as Angela for being members of this wonderful channel. If you guys want to get a shout out as well, all you got to do is go ahead, press the join button below, and very soon you'll get your very own shout out. As well, guys, the villagers have just reminded me that the majority of you aren't subscribed yet. So head down below as well, press the red subscribe button, along with the notifications bell. Well, villager, let me go and do this. Make sure to stay away from every single mob I spawn. I'm going to do it slightly further away from the village just to make sure we don't do anything that could destroy everyone. I'm going to spawn the first one, which is the Spartan, right here. Oh, it's a villager! <laughs> and look at him! He's roaming around instantly looking for monsters to kill, but I'm not sure he's found anyone. Do you know what? This would definitely be the best friend to have in a situation that could have dangerous golems in. I'm going to go ahead and spawn a friend for him like the villager god. <laughs> yes, we now have two friends protecting our whole village. But let's go and test out their skills by spawning the illager giant. Whoa, it's massive. So the illager is like a titan that's going to go ahead and destroy everything if we don't stop him. Now, let's help out our friend. Hopefully we should be able to fight him off as fast as we can. And he also has some insane powers that he gives us weakness and everything we probably can't handle. Quickly, let's get out of here. <laughs> He's going ahead and trying to destroy us as fast as he can. But I'm hoping maybe we can spawn a friend like the villager guard group. Yes, we now have so many friends. Let's go ahead and hope that they go ahead and stop this evil illager from destroying us, which is well too late. Well, let me spawn back and let's go and see if we can see the fight from here. Look, they're all going after him, which is absolutely perfect. How about I spawn another mob like the stone dirt golem? Let me do this one right here that we've already seen today. And hopefully we can figure out if it's friendly or completely evil. Yes, I think it's working. So it seems like the golem is actually trying to help us. And hopefully this illager hasn't got much health left. Let's go ahead and destroy him. And let's go and do this. Yes, we're so close. <laughs> yes, we've done it. That is perfect. Do you know what? Having this golem around has been the best thing so far. But sadly, we have lost so many friends, which is absolutely insane. But I can see that the golem is slowly by slowly resting to see if there's any more mobs. It's basically like having an iron golem in your village protecting everything. I'm going to spawn the Wither Skeleton Knight and let's go do it right here. Ah, it looks super dangerous. Okay, let me go fight it off before it gives us some dangerous obstacles that we might not be able to stop. Let's go and do this. I'm perfect. <laughs> that is so cool. But thankfully, it's gone ahead and given us a netherite outfit that should give us more power and more obstacles to defeat. Well, let's go and do this and let's swap everything around. I'm now ready to go ahead and spawn the player mech. Ah, oh, it's a mechanical robot that we can go ahead and use to fight off mobs. <laughs> this is the coolest thing ever. I wish we had this earlier on. This would have been the craziest thing to have by roaming around the village and fighting off some illagers. That would have been so insane. But you know what? We still have more spawners. So let me take out the wither sun, which I'm going to do right here. I'm perfect. And let's go destroy it with our mech. <laughs> yes. Okay, here we go. Thankfully, because of the mech, we should be able to go ahead and reach it from high up. Here we go. No, it seems to be slightly out of our reach. Okay, let's go and try this out. Sadly, this wither sun is actually a lot stronger than we thought. We might not be able to go ahead and fight him off as quick. Let's go ahead, reverse back, and let's go and try and get him stuck. Come on, perfect. We are doing this slowly, but it's going to be a long battle. Thankfully, our player mech is actually a lot stronger than we thought. 
but destroying this flying angel is the craziest thing ever. Yes, we are getting in a few hits. <laughs> Let's try and back up as fast as we can so our little guardians don't get destroyed. Let's go and do this now. Okay, do you know what, guys? I think we should be able to destroy this monster, but it is going to take such a long time. Sadly, he has made it rain, which is going to make this even more impossible for us. But thankfully, I think we should be able to do this. He is at about 90% health so far, but we are getting a few hits in. So let me keep on trying and let me go and do this. Guys, he's on his last few healths, but so are we. Let's go ahead and try and destroy him before he does it. Yes, I think we've destroyed him. This is perfect. Let's go and collect whatever he's dropped. And thankfully, it's now stopped raining. Okay, I don't seem to be able to find anything just yet. But I can still see the explosions going off. Villagers, stay away from this explosion site. Hopefully, there's no TNT in the ground that should destroy our mech. But you know what? That was the best thing ever. Being able to fight off dangerous mobs and have so much health was so fun. But sadly, part of our village has now been destroyed, so hopefully I can make it up by spawning more mobs and destroying these evil monsters. But first, I do want to go ahead and give the blacksmith some of his armors back. I'm sure he's worried about it. Hopefully he will go ahead and forgive us by taking all these items away by rewarding him with some netherite outfits. So let me throw in all these uh, iron items, which is definitely perfect for him as well as some netherite leggings some nether stars some of these bones as well as some saplings and loads of dirt and let me go ahead and spawn the rest of our spawners i'm gonna take out every single one let me go ahead and do the skeleton assassin right around here hopefully we have some more guardian friends to go ahead and help us nope i don't see any let me do the assassin right here and let's go see him. Whoa! <laughs> what is that thing? So every single time he touches us, he will go ahead and spawn more assassins, which is absolutely insane. But I've just noticed he's given us loads of those netherite outfits. Do you know what? These monsters give us such good armor. I love them so much. How about we go ahead and do the skeleton knight? Whoa! <laughs> okay, let's go and kill the skeleton knight and let's go survive this. Huh, what a crazy day. And next up, I do want to go ahead and do the Advanced Ravager. Whoa! That's got cannons on it! Okay, let's be super careful of this monster. Hopefully, we should be able to defend our village as fast as we can. No! Watch out! Let me go ahead and spawn a friend to help us out. Like the Iron Golem upgraded. <laughs> Whoa! Look at his green eyes. He's almost ready to go ahead and destroy everything. Okay, the Ravager is shooting his cannons. Let's spawn back and let's go make sure he doesn't destroy our golem. Here he goes. Come on. Whoa. So he goes ahead, decharges his arms and can destroy everything in its mist. That was the coolest fight ever. Do you know what? I'm going to try and keep this guy as close as possible. Let me spawn an ancient Spartan. Whoa, that's another golem that looks like a villager Spartan. That is the craziest thing ever. Now, I am hoping that's just a cape and it's not blood, but we'll be able to figure it out by spawning the snow monster. Whoa! Okay, let's go and destroy this guy as fast as we can. Thankfully, our golem Spartan is trying to help us out. But where is our upgraded golem? Let's go and do this. This should be pretty easy. Here we go. Let's all fight him together. Perfect. I think it's working. <laughs> ah! And he's upgraded as well. Do you know what? These monsters are the strongest golems I've seen. But hopefully we should be able to do it all together by defending the village. Sadly, the Spartan is slowly by slowly disappearing. But I think we've almost killed the snow monster. Have we done it? Yes, it worked. <laughs> that is so cool. And it's only given us a few ice that I won't be able to use, which is kind of a shame, actually. But I do have to go ahead and spawn the fat zombie villager. There it goes. <laughs> yes, it's working. Cool. Okay, this sounds absolutely insane. Watching two titans fight against each other is the craziest thing. And sadly, he's won. Okay, that was pretty close. If only we took a few fights, we should have been able to save that snow monster. Do you know what? I'm going to spawn the next one right in front of our upgraded golem. So let me throw away all these items that I won't need. Let me take out a few more spawners and let's go and do this. Let me spawn the Madalager. Wow, that's an illegit golem. Okay, this should be a pretty even fight. But I want to go ahead and help them out as much as possible. No, we should have helped him out as fast as we can. <laughs> and he's taken off his top. Okay, this is a pretty mad villager. Let me go ahead and destroy him as fast as we can. And this should work. There we go. And perfect. 
Wait! It killed us before we killed it. Okay, let's rush back and let's go and stop this evil mob. There he is. Trying to run off and kill some more of our villager friends. We can't let this happen. No! Leave the llamas alone. I can't believe it. If we don't help them out, no one else will. Perfect and good. Huh. Maybe we should spawn the rest away from the village. But I do want some help. So maybe if we go ahead and spawn... Let's do the forest guardian. Hopefully this one will go ahead and help us out with the next battle. I'm going to spawn it right around here. Perfect. Whoa! So whenever it walks, it will go ahead and spawn some yellow flowers. And it looks super scary, but I'm sure it's friendly. Yep, I think he is. So let me spawn a fat zombie right here. <laughs> wow! There it goes! Okay, this one is just slightly different to the fat zombie villager. So hopefully we should be able to destroy him as fast as we can. And then spawn the next one, which is the illager mech. Wow! Okay, let's go and stop this monster. I can't believe monsters like this are still roaming around in our spawners. Okay, let's go and do this. He's destroying all the flowers. No wonder the forest guardian is getting super mad. Here we go. Let's go and do this. <laughs> yes, we've done it. So now we should be able to go ahead and use this mech with his wonderful anvil hands. Do you know what? This is the coolest thing. Well, guys, let me go ahead, get out of this, and let me spawn the fat villager. Oh, perfect. So it seems like this guy will go ahead and help us out if we need some help. But as of yet, I don't think we need any. How about we do the hunt villager? Oh, what? <laughs> he has a gun. Okay, that was pretty insane. I can't believe it. And now the forest guardian is going absolutely mental. How about I spawn the last one, which is the skeleton king? Whoa! We've left the worst one till last. And he has so many insane powers. Let's go and do this. And perfect! I think it's working. Hopefully our forest guardian will try and help us out. Now! And he's spawning mutants. So let's go and do this. These minions can't survive it. There we go. And perfect! We should be able to destroy the majority of these mobs before we get destroyed. Okay, let's go back. Let's jump inside the mech. And hopefully the Sparta will help us out. Get him, monster, get him! <laughs> Hopefully he can take a few hits for us. Let's go and do this. I'm perfect. Yes! I think it's working. Perfect! We've done it. So all we've got to do now is go ahead, destroy his minions, and we should be done. But I've just noticed the Sparta is just running off. He doesn't want to help us out whatsoever. But I guess that's okay. Well, guys, I think we've done it, and we've destroyed every single evil monster. I can't believe the blacksmith was able to make all of these just inside his house. Let me throw in all the items once again that I won't be needing, which is basically netherite outfits. And I think we're completely done. Well, guys, I will see you soon in the crazy Minecraft video. And don't forget to like this video, subscribe down below if button is red, and don't forget to go ahead and press the notifications bell. And hopefully next time, we can spawn some more peaceful monsters, which would be absolutely awesome. So guys, I'll see you all soon. Peace out.